download for the 64. I already have did, done this already. Now I'm gonna take you guys step by step what's gonna happen now. After you download this, I believe you're gonna have two options. It's gonna call, you're gonna see Yuzi, Yuzu Nightly or Yuzu Canary. Now, it's very important you guys to pick Canary. The reason is for that because the night version is still in beta mode and can the user canary version makes every game works from 2d to 3d so that's the primary thing you guys need to do to use canary now after you pick canary users already install on your computer so go to wherever you chose to make users install on your computer let's see what i'm about to do right here i think i have users in my desktop version no, but I do not. So let's see, see right now. Canary. Anyone do checking for updates? Now, after you guys do that, make sure you go to file, open use you folder. Now this is very important. You have, first off, you won't have some of these. One of them I believe is keys. You have to make keys by yourself. And the way you do that is right, right click, I believe, press new, new folder, and it's all keys, lowercase. And then as you go to my key folder, you see I have these two. Now you won't have this from the start because keys generally makes the game working is the reason why I, th that makes the game work. And the best way to find some keys, I'm not gonna link this down below in the description due to uh, legal reasons all you need to do go on google type in uh, use the power key download and you go from there and uh, also the other things i want to show you is conf configurations to uh, the best configurations for yuzu so basically I have general like this. Make sure it's the same thing as me. You can make the theme dark if you want. It's up to you. Well, this is for like your, um, I believe your personal, you can have your username, you can have multiple save files by doing this. I just, I just keep it simple. I have one save file. I'm not too fancy with that. This off, this, just make sure everything is the same as me have your profile, put your birthdays and all that stuff. My profile, my audio. I like to keep my audio around 79, 80-ish because I don't want the game too loud. My graphics, and this is the the basic standard um, graphics for Mario Odyssey. If you're on like a regular PC or low end PC, this is like the basic standard. Um, if you wanna make it work like 100%, like 100% perfect. That's for like another video I show showcase you guys. And controls for my make sure it's custom because that's that's the best way to get the best experience for the games. It's on custom. You see, I have and make sure when you go to it when you first start it off. It might say it's a joy cons or something like that, but put pro controller. But the funny thing about it, pro controllers don't work as well as an xbox controller so my prefer my preferred way for you to do this is do the xbox controller and after that you configure and i believe you just plug in your xbox controller and then you go from there like say for example you want to press the button a press button you press this and then you press a all that good stuff and uh, also, one more thing. Um, I want to guys show you guys something. Um, I'll be leaving a link to the Mario Odyssey ROM, and when and make sure, and then when you download it, make sure you guys have WinRAR. That's like the best way to get it. WinRAR. See, I got Mario Odyssey through WinRAR. And then when you go back and make sure you put the folder. Just drag it, drag the folder right here, as you see right now. That's like the best way. Remove this right here. Computer's bugging. 
anyways after you do that the first time you won't get that so after you put after you drag it to the left right here we are um on your desktop you're gonna go to select game directory and after you do that this pc i'm gonna go to desktop and after you do that you just press select folder and after that it should pop up like that that's basically it and then after you do that you get the game running and you're basically good to go this is like basically the basic setting like like just like the beginner's guide it's not like nothing too advanced like having having like making it work 100% this like basically